hello everybody welcome back to the channel if this is your first visit thank you for stopping by I hope you'll consider subscribing and if you've been here before thank you for coming back so I'm doing my completed pages from November I just want to say I haven't done as many as I normally do it's simply the last two months of the year go completely manic what we're sorting stuff out for school plays um, taking my mum and dad to doctors for things like flu and Covid jabs and just generally existing um, it happens every year so I make all these major big plans for colouring and then uh, I don't get time to do it because obviously I'm so busy uh, but these are what I did colour and I'm very happy with what I coloured um, so let's go through it so uh, let's start with the first one which is the beauty of horror now I I, I did two buddy colours with Molly in this one as you know you saw one in October and then the second one was this but I didn't finish it in time for October so being so busy I finished it at the beginning of November and this was just used using various alcohol markers and that's what I like about these this small book um, I do have the Christmas one as well uh, that you can use alcohol markers in them because there's nothing really on the back you could color in that but so I like that so I've done an, one in there I think that was using the new markers that I got from TikTok shop. Another buddy colour I did with Molly was Tales from the Forest Kingdom. So I've done a few in this one because I just love this book. So I, I don't know if you can see the background, it stands out better in real life. It, it, you can see it a little bit. So the pencil work is done with the Black Widows. I am loving my Black Widows again at the moment and I'm using them. Um, I've got all the sets. Uh, then on top of the actual fairy dust I have put, I don't know if you can see it, if it sparkles, I, I did cover it with uh, Mod Podge so it might spark, it does sparkle and the background I did using the Boldmere Soft Pastels, these are from the works, I've never used pastels before, I bought some beauty blenders and practiced a little bit on a piece of paper just to see what it would look like and then I did a multicoloured background going from blue which is the colour there all the way to orange and I do like it and then I, have, I sprayed it with hairspray and it's, it's not coming off onto this page so I think spraying it with hairspray when I use those is the way to go. Um, I've got another buddy colour to do with Molly in December and I'm going to probably end up using the pastels again because I'm really I really enjoyed using them it's something different. I just gotta keep my craft nice away from Jennifer. Uh, the only other proper picture I did by that I mean not colour by number or pattern was one from Kobe Rosanna's Phantomorphia. I started this in October the glitter pen I was using ran out, I had to go and find the refills for it because it was the colour to Chromatech ones and uh, I couldn't be bothered because they were at the bottom of the box. In the end I found them and I finished it off and I did this lovely pumpkin. I love this. This is definitely, along with the one from Tricks or Treats, one of, I, I mean I love all the, the three main pictures, proper pictures, three non-pattern or colour by numbers pictures I should say. I love and I love them all really a lot. I just love the way this looks and it's so shiny. <laughs> And it was mostly uh, Chromatech and Link Shine, and then a few odd ones thrown in for good measure. I did a Christmas a Mandala colour by number. This is a book by uh, Sachin and Sashdeva. I think it was one of the first ones I got. And I just did this lovely little one. Again, using the alcohol markers from TikTok Shop. I'm using them a lot. Jennifer likes them as well, so we're both happy. I did one in here, 100, malas, 100 Easy Mandalas, such and such Deva. And again, TikTok shop markers, no issues with them. Like those markers, they are really good. I'm gonna be honest, they're cheap, but they work really well. Again, I did Stained Glass Christmas, colour by number. Again, such and such Deva. Do you think I like these books? Yes, I do. And um, we did the little nutcracker. I did make a mistake, as you can see here, but uh, only just, I think, if you have a look, it's the wrong colour. Um, when I make a wrong colour, I just carry on. doesn't matter. There's nothing wrong with art. Sometimes we change it. Then I did a couple in 100 Best Adult Colour by Number by Sun Life Drawing. I do like this book. I did the two birds pictures. I did one, the second bird picture, which was this one. 
again these are the markers from TikTok shop I will be getting more of them and I did the artwork a girl with a pearl earring from famous uh, paintings so I like this book probably do some more in here even though it's not a Christmassy one because I'm just colouring I want to without going mad on Christmas there will be Christmas ones Right, onto the books I was working in to try and complete. Um, I'm not going to complete any more this, this year. I'm sorry, Chelsea. I'm one, one short for the year. I've got two pictures left. I will be doing one this month. In November, let me get back to it, I did this girl. And I did it like this because I wanted to do her, her in for Halloween. But I never got around to it. Sort of like a gothic -y look. I didn't do a background. I just did the picture I enjoyed doing it it was really nice and simple again markers from TikTok shop <laughs> and I did one in creative haven rose windows I've only got five left in this it will be finished um, next year definitely I did this one this again these are using the markers from Lidl's because I just love the way they look nice and quick and I did one in kawaii color by numbers um, by Color Questopia. So, I can't even speak. This was done using the markers from TikTok Shop as well because I just like using them. I just use whatever markers around. If I'm in my bedroom, it's the Arteza Everblend or my big mixed bag box of them. If I'm in the spare room uh, where my office is, it tends to be the uh, Oh Hoo Hoos. And if it's downstairs, it's TikTok Shop ones. So, there we go. But those are all I coloured in the month of November um, yeah not as many as I would have liked but still I did enjoy doing it like I said the three pictures that I showed you first are my favorites but I can't choose out of them because they're just so brilliant so I hope you've enjoyed this very 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 quick video and I will see you very very soon for another one bye guys